All right, so now that we have everything set up and ready to go, let's start learning about Nux itself. So the first thing that we're gonna take a look at is how to create pages within a Nux application. So as I mentioned a few times already throughout this course, the app.view file is going to be the main entry file, very similar to how we have the app.view file within a normal view project. Now, when using view, if you wanted to create a new page, or I guess you can call it a route, what you would do is you would create a views folder and then create your view. And then you would head over to your router file and you'd create that route that connects to that component. Now within Nux, it works a little bit different and it's actually a little bit easier. So Nux works on what is called file-based routing. So to show you how this works, what we can do is inside of our app folder, we wanna create a new folder and we wanna call this pages. Now within this pages folder or directory, we wanna create our new page. So we wanna create our home directory or our home page. So what we can do is within this pages folder, we wanna create a new file called index.view. And within this file, we can use our extension we have called view VS code snippets, and we can use the command vbase three setup, and we wanna use a TypeScript version. Now we're gonna be using tailwind, so we don't need to have our style tag. And then what I like to always do is I like to have my script tag on top of my template, and that is just my personal preference. Now inside of our template, we have a div. So for now, let's just add an H1, and we'll just call this home page like this, okay? So now if we head over to our application, you can see that we're on the home route, but we still see our hello message, which is coming from the app.view. Now, the reason why we're not seeing our home page content and we're still seeing this hello message is because Nux does not know we have other pages inside of our application. So in order to display those pages we have inside of our pages directory, we need to use a component that they provide to us called Nux page. Now, one thing that you're going to notice is that whenever we use a component within Nux, whether it be one they're providing to us, such as the Nux page component, or one of our own components that we build later throughout this course, we don't need to import these as we did within Vue. Nux actually is going to auto import all components for us, which in my opinion is a really nice thing. So essentially this Nux page component is just a wrapper of the router view component that we have when we build applications with Vue 3 and the Vue router. So now that we have this imported into our app.view, any page that we navigate to that exists inside of our pages directory will now see within our application. So with this implemented, you can see now inside of our application, since we're on the home directory or the root, we see the value of home page. So with file-based routing, how this works is under the hood, whenever we create a new page inside of our pages directory, a new route is also created for that under the hood by Nuxt. So in this example, we had a index.view page. So what this correlates to is just going to be the route of slash. So for example, if we were to create a page such as about.view, then that route would be created for us automatically. And then the route would be slash about. But since we don't have an about page created right now inside of our application, if we do attempt to navigate to the about page, we're going to get a 404 page not found error. 